Hello, my name is Carter Huffman, CTO and co-founder at Modulate. Our flagship product is ToxMod, an AI-driven solution to help video game moderators quickly, accurately, and proactively detect and address toxicity in voice chat. ToxMod is incredibly customizable and can help community moderator teams at studios of all sizes better protect their players. While we won't be able to show you all of our amazing features today, I want to show you some of the highlights within ToxMod's web console. I'll be showing you how to navigate ToxMod to get a fast and informative look into the kinds of disruptive behavior occurring in your community. First, let's check out the overall dashboard and walk through some of the key stats you'll have access to as a moderator. This view can be changed based on the specific needs of your game, but here are some generally useful features across the board. At the top, we get a sense of scale of voice chat and voice toxicity in your community. So we see things like how many voice chat sessions are happening, how many people are exposed to harmful behavior, etc. We can also see the average incident response time. This shows the typical amount of time between someone violating your code of conduct until you take action on that offense using ToxMod, either manually or automatically. Next, let's look at the live streams page, which is a heads up view of the worst violations of your content policy happening in your game right now. From here, moderators can take actions like warning, muting, or banning players. These are fully customizable based on the moderation policy of your studio. On the left side, you'll see the user ID and session ID, which help give you a sense of where this behavior is happening and which players are involved. In the middle column, you can see an at-a-glance transcript of the voice chat in question, as well as the language spoken, derived directly from the audio content itself. The score column here gives a value that rates the offense, where higher scores indicate a more severe violation of your code of conduct. ToxMod itself is customizable to adapt to your code of conduct. For example, you might prioritize adult language as more severe in a game that is meant for children. However, you might deprioritize adult language in a game intended for adult players, but escalate other offense categories like hate speech or sexual harassment. On the right side, you can click here to expand each of these examples to be able to listen to the associated audio clips directly. Along the top, we see that score and offense category again but also the number of other players who were exposed to this instance of toxicity, which gives moderators a sense of the impact of the behavior. Thanks for joining me for a quick overview of ToxMod and how it works. But there are so many more features and customizations like proximity voice chat compatibility, player report correlations, and more. So if you want a deeper understanding of ToxMod and how it helps combat toxicity in gaming, visit our website at modulate.ai or send us a message at contact at modulate.ai.